years, music lovers across Skinny Atlas have experienced the theatrics. Why, that's strange. I can read it. And you didn't believe me. And musicality. Skinny Atlas Festival. They're hearing Beethoven under the stars. Every summer since 1980, Louise Robinson has hosted the festival on the back porch of her home, Brook Farm, on Skinny Atlas Lake. The music festival just happened suddenly in our lives. But after more than three decades, it's simply time to move on. Because the festival is evolving. Yeah. This is something that's growing very slowly, and it's time to just keep moving ahead. This is a way to do it. About a mile down the west end of the lake, Angela's Vineyards will be the new site of the festival, featuring an amphitheater and seating for hundreds. I think it's very exciting. I really do. This venue will still be under construction during this summer's concerts. However, by next year, it'll be open. And already there's a great deal of anticipation. This is the perfect setting for any type of musical event. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. The gardens, the lake, the view that you have, there's just nothing better. A mix of emotions. We were happy to have Brook Farm involved for 35 years, and now it's time to do something a little different, and this is going to be great. Saying goodbye to something you love this year, while also being excited for what's to come next year. In Skinny Atlas, this is Alex Rosilla.